So now that we've got our hands on both the Switch and PlayStation 4 versions of Team Sonic Racing, it's time to put them side by side to see what compromises they had to make. For starters, it is running at a lower frame rate at 30fps opposed to 60, but we're going to compare the load times and visuals to see just how it holds up. Ready? Oh yeah! Alright, we're going to start off by doing a low comparison for Planet Wisp. The timer starts when it fades out, and stops when it fades back in. And after this we'll do a low comparison for getting back to the main menu from the race. Okay, so those are really close, and kind of interesting, as the Switch loads faster when getting back into the menu, only slightly, and the PlayStation 4 loads the race faster by about 4 seconds. Nothing too crazy to note there. But anyway, let's look at how the game itself looks. What do you guys think? I still find that the Switch version is really fun to play, and artistically the game still looks fantastic. But is the lower frame rate a deal breaker for you, or are you planning to pick up the game anyway? Let us know in the comments below, and of course be sure to subscribe to Game Explain for a lot more on Team Sonic Racing and other things gaming too. Until next time, bye.